So this will take a little bit of getting used to, I think. Laser pointer works. Looks good, a nice little red dot. I like that the button for the laser pointer is nice and big. So what we have today is a new laser pointer. Now, for years, let me find one. For years, I've been using uh, one of these laser pointers from Logitech. They are excellent. Um, I even had the older model before that. It was like green or dark gray and silver. Uh, I had the silver trim, plastic trim, made to look like uh, aluminum around the outside and two big buttons on the top. That was my favorite one. Um, but I let my students use those and they've lost the uh, USB adapters that come with them. So then I had to switch to these. There's one that comes without the like little LCD here too. And I have a couple of those as well. But as you can see for mine, um, the um, buttons are well-worn. And so I get a lot of use out of these. Um, but I was uh, wandering around on Amazon the other day um, and I saw this, which is the Canon wireless presenter. And I thought um, I would give this a try um, it has pretty much all the same features that my Logitech one does, and the price was com comparable. I don't remember if it was cheaper or more expensive or what. And so I figured I'd give it a shot. Uh, I like kind of the look of it. Um, so we'll see. It is, um, comes in this clamshell. It's definitely not frustration free, but it's not as bad as a clamshell could be. I got my utility knife ready, but I don't think I'm gonna need it. Most of it just kind of rips apart. Let's get rid of that. And then I've got more stuff in here. Okay. So it looks like what we have is some AA batteries, a pouch, which I like this pouch a lot, and I like this, I like the feel of this remote. It, it feels really good in hand. So let's see what we've got here. We've got a timer you can set and timer setting button. Um, play, I'm assuming that's set to F5. Uh, hopefully we'll test it out. Um, blank screen, which is probably set to the B button uh, for use in PowerPoint. You got off, keynote, and PowerPoint. Oh, that's cool. So you could set it for a keynote on Mac or PowerPoint for PC. Um, I like that, although I have a feeling this button is gonna confuse a lot of attorneys that I give this to. We'll see how that turns out. And then I wonder, how do you turn it on? Let's get the batteries out. Okay, batteries are in. PowerPoint, and that's on. Cool. So the off button is off, Power Keynote, and PowerPoint. So I'm guessing the difference is for Keynote, this button is not set to B and this button is not set to F5. It's probably set to command enter or I, what, what, what were the, I don't remember what the key, the keystrokes are for, um, for PowerPoint, uh, for Keynote, how to get the slideshow started. But there's that. Okay, that's not too bad. Another USB connector, it's fine. This thing keeps flashing here. I don't know what that does. I got it plugged in, okay. Ah, all right, so it's plugged in. It lets me know that it's connected to a laptop. Let me open up a, just an empty PowerPoint presentation here. And then we'll add just a whole bunch of slides. I'm seeing my slides are advancing, that's fine. Laser pointer works. Looks good, a nice little red dot. I like that the button for the laser pointer is nice and big. So that's like usually the only question that I get other than how do I go forward and how do I go back? So pretty cool. I'm excited about this. Something different to try. Nice to see that there's other manufacturers getting kind of into this space. So I like it. I do like, even though I don't have any clients that use Keynote anymore because PowerPoint for Mac OS has gotten really uh, robust. So, um, I don't really need it, but it's nice to know that it's there in case I do have a client that runs into that issue. That's it for the Canon wireless presenter. I'm just gonna slide the um, dongle right back in or the wireless receiver back in, get it back in the case. And yeah, I like it.
I like it more than the Logitech. I think just generally because Logitech has kind of been stepping away from uh, some of their more businessy products. They're trying to get into more purely like kind of like the gaming and like home tech kind of side. Um, I think that products like this are gonna be useful and necessary in the marketplace. And so I really like this. Plus, because it says Canon on there, it makes it seem a little bit more like official. So when I'm handing it to like an attorney that I'm working with, I think that's gonna be um, really nice uh, for them to hold rather than something from like Logitech, which might be like the makers of like their kids gaming mouses and stuff like that. So um, I like it. I'm gonna try it out in the field this week. We've got a trial coming up. So I think this is gonna be um, a nice little uh, a new addition uh, to, to the tech back.